I just flex. I get checks, ice my neck and my chest, uh. We the best, we don't care about who next, uh. I get texts, touch that LAX, uh. We don't stress. Bro, we in a Tesla. Only playing nine minutes a game, played a season high 15 minutes in the game against Portland. Bosch gets the foul as Hibber gets the end one. By Paul George against the Blitz. He actually splits James and Bosch with a behind the back pass. And then Hibbert with good agility to finish on the other side of the rim. Hibbert backing on Oden. Seven early points for Roy Hibbert more trouble against teams that front him versus just play behind him. I don't think he's going to have trouble getting quality shots off against Odin because Odin is allowing the easy catch. He's going to be around in front, but give Hibbert credit. Easy catch and then goes by Odin. Again, good agility, going to the other side of the rim and finishing. To a guy like Hibbert by showing him no respect at all and going right at him, just like Anderson did. Roy Hibbert must have a great soft spot in his heart for Miami. He sees the name Miami on a uniform where he, and the best in Roy Hibbert comes out, 11 early points. Usually you see them working the baseline or the sideline part a bit more. Anderson trying to make it tougher for Hibbert who caught it outside the paint, but walked his way in. 13 for Roy Hibbert on six of seven shooting. See, that's too many dribbles to allow on the back end where no one comes and tries to dig the ball out. They've played a much better offensive first half. That man a big reason why. Seven field goals for Hibbert. He has 17 points. First double-digit lead of the night. James attacks from the top right at Hibbert. Big contact. Hibbert took the worst of that. It's a foul on James. And Hibbert is the one who's shaken up. Well, James attacks. Hibbert goes up. Gets him with the elbow across the chin. And Hibbert's still down as Josh Corbo, the athletic trainer for the Pacers, is out to look at him. And that's got to be looked at as a flagrant foul. Just to see if there's enough to call it flagrant. And now the fans here wanting that same treatment. And the three officials come over as Hibbert woozy as he took that elbow right across the chin. Able to get up. And the ruling on the floor was just a common foul. So... They'll take a look to see if it's a flagrant, and the medical staff will continue to evaluate Hibbert. But they can't look at it unless they call it flagrant. And so it'll be interested if they're calling it flagrant right now as Hibbert gets up and falls back down. I get text, touchdown LAX, uh, we don't stress. Bro, we in the Tesla.